Okay, this is just a quick overview of the um, biohazard suits for Genesis 8 Mail. First off, you can find it under your Dose Studio library under People, under Genesis 8 uh, Males, under Clothing, and then there'll be a directory called Midnight Stories and Biohazard. Now, um, I'm the first off, the first thing I'm going to say is do not um, load uh, Genesis 8 Mail up. Use the, the, the first one that you see in the Biohazard one, which is called Biohazard G8. Now, why is that? Is because I've got um, the neck um, locked and the head has limits on it. This is, you'll see why. Um, in a moment. So you just double click on that and this will just load up um, load up the default scene. Why is that? It's to stop the head from going through the back of the suit here and that's just that's basically the only way I could do it with the, um, with this uh, helmet on it. Um, if, if you use that and follow that you'll be fine. So what comes with this um, pack? It's um, obviously the boots, the suit, the gloves, there'll be um, the gas marks, the helmet, and also the, the backpack comes with it as well. Um, so um, the material pack, let's um, have a check in the, in the scene before you apply some of the materials. Make sure you have the biohazard um, G8M selected and then we'll just go to under the directory under materials. Now these are all hierarchical materials so if you've got that selected just double click. That's black. green red white and the, the default um, yellow Um, comes with uh, five poses, so they're um, just basically that one is sort of a, a fun one that if a zombie's coming towards him, he's saying back off. That's just a, a careful one when he's just treading carefully through the thing. Just uh, that one's just pointing over at something. Just a general walking one. And uh, this one's just doing a, a basic search on the ground. Now, with this um, one, there is a, a slight fault when the two legs come together. They're, it'll cause just a a small crease in the um, under the uh, um, in the where the leg groin is but I've got a little fix up for there so um, open up your biohazard um, subset select the suit go to your um, shaping morph and there'll be um, uh, double thigh smooth and I know I could have put this in automatically but there it doesn't give you the full this gives you a lot more control over when you're you're going to use it so just be mindful of that if you're going to use um, um, suits that um, um, poses that have the the um, 
the thighs both facing forward so I just um, thought I'd show you that so we'll turn it back off um, we'll put him back into um, the zero pose again whoops make sure we have the Genesis 8 male selected before we do that Now the suit also comes with uh, with uh, legs up. Um, I mean trousers up morph. So um, I'll I'll say use it sparingly in um, poses that um, say we a, an ordinary walking pose would be fine. So again, open up your scene, go to suit. And under there, there's a trousers up morph. We'll just pull that up like that. So, but if you're going to bend the knees, be mindful that sometimes it might create a, like a gap there. So just take it easy. All right. So you're not seeing it there. So so just be mindful of that um, morph. So in most cases it'll be fine. So so um, that's about it. That's all you need to to know for this. Load the up the um, subset first. That's the easiest way <coughs> to do things. Oh, another little thing that I want to show you. It comes with um, props, lighting props, which um, I'll just drag and drop on to this guy. And you can see it should light um, down the bottom a bit. Here's the... T we'll drop that. And you can see it lights up the, the top of the, the helmet as well. So we'll just zoom in on there. I do have... Um, you can turn them off and on in the material sets I've got all um, different um, for suits and that also on the lights so you can turn the lights off and on as needed but make sure you've got um, the the actual the actual uh, the chest of um, the, the bio suit selected so if we wanted to turn the top one off we we have that selected and just double click it and that'll turn turn it off or turn it on as as needed same with the the bottom one as well so um, that's just a brief overview of um, what's in the pack and any things that you need to know Thanks, I uh, hope you have fun with it.